The Old Guard Fife and Drum Corps travels all over the world. Um, some of the places that, that I've had the privilege of performing um, have been Hawaii, um, just recently at the White House for the arrival of the Pope um, and President Barack Obama. Throughout the piece, so we don't need it to be, you know, we just want it to be nice and soft underneath them. One of the big things for a, for a drum line is that um, you're taking different people with different backgrounds and you're, you're playing music together. So you need to be on the same page. You need to be um, kind of synced up with the people around you so that you're all thinking about the rudiments of music um, and these patterns in the same way so that everything sounds the same, looks the same, and translates to the audience. Constant practice is, is pretty vital to our role as the Old Guard Fife and Drum Corps. Um, a lot of it has to do with the physical muscle ability to be able, the, the fast twitch muscles, things like that, to actually be able to play um, at the, with the technique that we play at the speeds that, that we try to play in a lot of our shows and drum solos. Um, so constant work is, is usually needed to, to keep those skills honed. So we want it to, to diminish in, in volume, but we still want the clarity of all those notes. Right, um, so da 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 I love being a musician in the United States Army Fife and Drum Corps. Um, my wife also performs in the Corps and my brother-in-law is here as well. Um, but it's more than that for me. Being with these soldiers and performing at the level that, that the people surround me here perform is just an incredible honor and opportunity every day. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, the United States Army Old Guard Fight and Drum Corps.